A very warm greetings to Sri Prabhakar Sastri Garu. This is Syed Shabrin Taj from Vishwam School CBSC. I would like to share a few thoughts about your empowerment program. Every day it's like a wonderful day to us. A very, very day, every day new things come to us to learn. From I, I would like to start from day one. It's all about teaching. Teaching is not a job but a deep meditation. We have to overcome from our strength and weaknesses. We have to apply all your our strength, energy and all efforts for the students. Look, we have to looking at the child as an individual. We have to balance in teaching with harmony in behavior. We should have to do self-discipline, self-control and have to control our anger. We should increase mental and physical power. We don't we do not have to teach in class. We have to perform in the class. Keeping acquired knowledge and delivering our full fledged teaching. We should not keep pet children. Let your ego aside and learn from the child or other te other teachers. Unconditional love, unbiased love towards the child we should show. The language should come from your heart, not from your mouth. Any language will speak if you express. Let's come to the matters of teaching English. We should follow as usual lesson plan. Then we should talk about the poet and author many more. We should maintain stress and strain and the word and pronunciation. Meaning or meanings and grammar. Then reading lesson by the children, preparing the questions by making groups, enact the story, examination point of view at last. By every day we have an activity. So first day activity, from that activity we should make the child to improve his memory power by making or conducting memory games. Make the child to be attractive to the teaching by the teacher. Increase their memory and concentration levels and attention in a play way. Then coming to the day 2, we come to know the creative parenting. Every child is unique, born with a different purpose. Make the child to realize every work has its own importance. We should appreciate others by their work. We have to know the value of family relationship and also we should make the child to know the value of family relationships. We should appreciate and helping others, other persons who knows the suffering to of other people to get things done. Every employee worked divergently and as a team we have to perform tremendously. They know the difficulties and learn the abilities to work with their and also others to get the things done. Primary teachers, especially, I am also a primary teacher, always we should do commanding voice. They should not be, they should be friendly with them. If we follow the legend way, that legend way of teaching, the child will skill with the subject. By doing the second day activity, there is some uh, reverse instructional activities are there. By these games and our activities, we can develop the child's memory span and attention and the concentration levels we can improve. Next, we are coming to day 3. They are the centers for, centers for learning. If a child goes to some place, he will get some information about it. There are two types of learning, cons conscious learning and unconscious learning. We should implement object learning with our sense to improve our linguistic vocabulary. Language should promote at home. Every parent should support for reading and learning from home. We should follow students oriented learning. The teacher should take the teaching to practical level. We should add aesthetic sense to our teaching and presentation. Every child have to mind free and ambitions. Give them a healthy mind, healthy habits with your interaction. Then we are coming to day 3 activity. We played a wonderful and tremendous game of playing with all our senses. Through the game, we, 
we fully involved with our all senses and we also have to involve the child or the student by uh, to utilize all his senses to understand the lesson or the teaching or any activity also then next day we about, we learned about the divergent thinking our mind is full of memories memory is needed to only extend the forms we should follow the total attentive mind make the child to be attentive in the class we should think creative in the child will think out of the box we should make the child to think out of the box we can understand the students by make your life peaceful take the flexibility of the child to be flexible in your teaching methods focus on everything that you want to change in your class thinking other side of the coin we should always think the positive or negative points of how we should go to the thinking what is going to happen and next all we should think the other side of that make the child to make to step into the theme of conventional conventional thinking next making them to be competition and to be the comparison of the other bodies collaborate with others and be cooperative to the teachers and friends make the child to think in different way for regular moral stories by using picture storytelling be professional make the child brain to overcome from bad memories by coming to day 4 we are use by using our regular scoff uh, how can uh, we have to think divergent and we have to be competitive for the others how can we use it in different ways same way we have to improve the child in the divergent thinking and make the child to be cooperative and competitive to become a good example in the society next coming to day 5 student oriented teaching with a smile on your face we should be maintain in our school your teaching should reach the student give the children education and academics in the century both are important prepare the subject what you are going to teach prepare the child and make him to connect to what we have taught yesterday and today your mind must be fresh and prepared while you entered in the class show the sympathy to the average students we have to educate the child thank you so much sir again we have we are happy to hear you if any chance is there we have to meet you directly then we have to interact with you thank you so much sir